today I'm out at a farm pond and my plan is to make a trip around the pond and see what I can catch. I'm starting out with a Z-Man Micro 1 8 ounce chatterbait and it's got a Z-Man TRD Hogs as a trailer. When I turned around I thought I had a bad camera angle and worried I didn't get myself on camera. All right, got my first one on the Z-Man micro chatterbait. I don't think I got any of it on camera, but that's the first one of the day. Let's see if we can get a few more and get the camera angle set up a little bit better here. I don't know, I guess I was filming my truck or something. Let's see if we can get a little bit better shot of the water here. But it seems like the the TRD hogs on this little chatterbait is just like a Ned Rig chatterbait. I think it's going to be really good. I'm halfway around the pond and I've already lost my chatterbait. Got a little one there on the Ned rig. Now this is just embarrassing. Goodness. I still think it takes talent to catch small fish with a bigger hook. Oh, my, my. That's just pitiful. There's a couple other ponds on this property, and they're full of pads and grass, but they're maybe only about two feet deep at most. My trip around the pond didn't go so great, so I decided to try this area that has about the only open water from the bank. I keep yelling at my GoPro to quit start recording right here. Then I finally realize it was already recording. GoPro, start recording. GoPro, start recording. <sighs> All right, hang on. <sighs> I 
I really hate trying to grab these slimy, toothy critters. Big ol' Murphy. Uh, not one I wanted to catch, but it sure was a good fight. Whew. Well, that was interesting. I hate dealing with mudfish to get them off, but man, they sure do try, uh, hit aggressively and they're a good fight thanks for joining me today and until next time get out there and cast your cares away